Good afternoon everyone, I'm back with Mr. Rana. Today we're looking at specification on the Revelto, the Aventador replacement. Deliveries of this car will start to land around 2024. Uh, Mr. Rana's keen to do his own specification today. Some of the early cars will be pre-specified with options, but we are keen to go through every option to get all the fine detail to make sure we have the perfect car. Okay, we're going to start with the exterior of the car. We're just going to go over base colour to begin with on the vehicle, which will allow us to see all of the additional options with the new wheels, the high gloss black pack, and also the carbon fibre packages. Okay, we're going to start looking at the wheels on the new Revelto because there's three new designs, and out of the three wheels, two of them are 20 inch at the front and 21 inch at the rear. But there's no the top option on size. Uh, the new wheel here, as you can see, 21 inch and 22 inch at the rear. So naturally we're going to go for the bigger looking wheel and we're going to finish the centre of the wheel with the carbon emblem and the centre of the crest. Moving on from the wheels, we're going to jump now to the high gloss black package, which you can see on the details tab. So when you go into the style package here, there's an option for high gloss black. So what that will do is it will highlight key areas on the car that are normally in a matte finish and put them to high gloss black. This will then just define the areas on the car a lot more and they'll be a lot more visible to the eye. I'll just change the colour so you can see that, just one second. When you have a matte coloured car, you cannot have high gloss black pack. So you have to have a gloss coloured car. And if I change this now, you'll see the areas on the screen Will change to high gloss black. So all the front grill area, the side sills, the air vents, the supports below the wing mirrors, the top of the bonnet uh, and some other areas all in high gloss black. Over and above that if we scroll down there is the lovely carbon options. So there's three options on the carbon. So the exterior which has all the front air vents, lower lip spoiler, the surrounds below the headlights, uh, if you hit the information tab here, we'll also show you what else it covers. The rear diffuser, the rocker cover, which we know is the side skirt, which runs down the side of the car. So that'll be a very nice option to have. Below that, we have the exterior upper package, which will also do the top of the bonnet, the wing mirrors, complete wing mirrors, and also the new large air vents, top and bottom. So we click that one on there. We'll show this in a bit more detail and the last option for the exterior carbon is a new door fin so it's quite a large area so if we look on the the the, the car here you can see when it's not carbon it's body color if we then click on the option you see it change it makes quite a big difference as you can see there let's jump the image change but this part was yellow and now it's finished in carbon fiber Okay, so just jump to the, the rear view of the Revelto, the whole balance there and complete carbon fibre. We also changed the exhaust tailpipes to the matte black finish because they're in a silvery grey finish as standard. And you can just see the side of the rocker cover as it's called. Um, this is also finished in the carbon fibre. If I flick to the next image, you'll also see the new parts we just talked here, the spin at the bottom of the door, and then also the rocker cover that goes all the way down the side of the car. And towards the headlight, there's also some lovely detail and carbon all around the headlight here. Okay, we've now confirmed Mr. Rana's exterior options on the Revelto. We're now going to jump inside and look at the new interior trims. Whole new interior for the Revelto, different design on the seats, the dashboard, everything is completely different. And there's a lot of carbon areas as standard on the car and some new displays which we'll show you. For example, the passenger display here, which is an option. 
Also the cup holders here, which are also an option. Um, there's also a lot more area below this floating center console here. Um, we have more, a lot more storage, a glove box, as well as door pockets. So it's a lot more accommodating as an interior of a car. As you can see the rear, you still have a, a rear bench also behind the seat where you can have luggage bags if you're going on a drive. This particular spec, Mr. Ron has looked at the carbon options and we've gone for the carbon steering wheel. This is the first time Lamborghini have had a carbon steering wheel in the modern range of Lamborghini. And also the paddles to change gear also are finished in carbon fiber. Okay, we have some new options on the Revelto. I'm gonna run through with Rana and yourself so you can understand. Um, new ones to me, so bear with me. Um, some are reminiscent from the Urus, so we have the surround assistance package. So if we just hit, hit the eye information here, it would just tell us that's lane change assist with front cross traffic assist also. So the car will brake itself uh, if somebody was trying to cut you up or cut in front of you and cause an incident for you to brake. The highway assist here is reminiscent from Urus. This is your radar cruise control, so you can set it on the autostrada or motorway a certain speed and it will keep a distance from the car in front of you. If we move down, there's a new option, headlamps package. So if we click on the eye here, that will tell you that we knew, have some new matrix LED beam headlights that are adaptive with a high beam and automatic high beam function. Moving away from that into the audio side of things, you have the smartphone interface. So with the smartphone interface, it allows you to control apps from your Apple phone be it, or your Android phone. So you can use Google Maps or Apple Maps, for example, and also Spotify if you were to use that for music. Another new option which we would normally see on uh, Urus product, for example, or a vehicle that's to be used in wintry conditions, the tree, the pre-trip climber, I should say, um, is an electric heater where you can pre-warm the vehicle uh, to a set temperature before you access the car. Okay, so we have five colour combinations we've chosen for Mr. Rana. Please help him in the comments section with your decision. So I'm going to show you the colours, the exterior finishes. Starting with the orange, this is the new Arancio colour, which is the launch colour for the new Revelto. Moving across, this colour is known, it's Viola Bast. Fabulous colour, with the diamond cut new wheels. Jumping across to the yellow which in my opinion suits a V12, looks incredible. Next colour we went with blue, just to be different. Mr. Rana's not had a blue car before, so we could break the mould. And then lastly, matte green. Okay, that is the specification wrapped up for Mr. Rama. Hopefully next time I see you, it will be in a glamorous location, handing over his new car in the color that you're gonna help him choose. Bye for now.